YouTube, how you doing today? Dolph Riddle here, bringing you Call of Duty Black Ops 2 sniping gameplay once again, like every other fucking video. But today, what I wanted to talk about was something that I find a little bit hilarious a lot of the time. And that is, why don't our parents like us playing Call of Duty? They come up with so many stupid excuses as to why COD's bad for you. But I don't think any of them are actually even true. What What's going on? Because I, I think my parents always think that if I just sit there and play Call of Duty all day, I'm going to become like a serial killer or some shit. And how many times do you think a Call of Duty player has really turned into a serial killer? Because if it's any less than 12, I'd be, I'd be pretty surprised. But I know the biggest thing that my parents always thought is they thought me sitting in my room for 12 hours a day playing Black Ops 2 was anti-social or something. But I just told her that one day it might come down to it where quickscoping might actually save my life. I think I talk about quickscoping more on a daily basis than I do about any of that algebra shit that I learnt in maths. And I'm pretty sure a lot of parents will say that like some sort of studies have shown that playing video games can make you more of an angry person. But honestly, I just think it's lag that makes people an angry person, not the actual video game itself. Like, what makes you more angry? Getting quickscoped or getting a two-bar connection? So next time your mum tells you that Call of Duty is making you angry, just tell her, Mum, you can get fucked. It's that shitty fucking internet that you pay for that makes me fucking angry. I don't think parents understand how much effort it takes to be a fucking quickscoper. They don't understand the reflexes you have to have. Because I'm pretty sure a Call of Duty player's reflexes is much better than a fucking ninja's. And I know something that I've always found so fucking hilarious is when... The amount of times that my parents have told me that dinner's ready, and I just haven't gone because I've been playing COD. And I'm not sure if that's just me, so I want you to like this video if you've ever been called out for dinner, but you haven't gone because you've been like, Mum, the game's nearly fucking finished! Give me some time! And then two minutes later, she's all like, Hurry up! And you're like, Mum! Quiet! So when it comes down to it, never let your parents tell you that video games are bad. Just keep on playing them. And always fight for those video games. Always fight for Call of Duty. Never stop playing it just because your parents told you that it's not good for you. Just tell them that some dude on the internet said that Call of Duty can save your life one day. Because hey, although Call of Duty's never saved anyone's life so far, it might one day. Ring a ring a rosy, a pocket full of posy. I'll dick you, I'll dick you, you all fall down. Ah! Oh! 